You get to run around on the next play. That's what you get to do, Jim. Yeah, they snap it. They get it back to him. Montgomery had taken the snap. Trubisky launching it right back to Wims, and he drops a touchdown. The pass was perfect. What a oh play. Oh, my gosh. This is, this is exactly what we were talking about, Jim, right here is look at He's wide open by himself. He just made the hard catch, and now the easy one. It's right there. He's got no one. I mean, the defender's on the ground. You see Williams there. And Koo is up, and he is no good! He sliced it! The Chiefs are going to hang on and get the number one seed. Mechanics are all good. Snap hold. As you, as you said, Kevin, that, that just sliced out to the right. On their last touchdown. He Head last in the league in rushing. Well, and they start with a horrible snap all the way back to the two-yard line and the Browns bouncing into the end zone where they wind up with a touchdown. Of all crazy things, you don't go to the playoffs for 18 years and that is the way it starts in the first 14 seconds. Carl Joseph winds up with the ball and they will celebrate. Unreal beginning to this one. <laughs> what do you say? You got your great veteran center pouncy right here is going to try and take a quick step to the left, and he just shoots it right over the head of six foot four Ben Roethlisberger. Played for the Cardinals on their offensive line. It's also Devon's dad. Dalton inters nearly intercepted. Jordan Hicks had it, and then he didn't. He was thinking six right there wow buddha baker sets this play up the safety comes off the edge here he is right here coming up he's going to come off and eventually get the pressure on andy dalton and dalton's just trying to get rid of the ball lewis and he throws it right to hicks yeah he does and the reason why he had to pump fake that ball is because deontay thompson the free safety did a nice nice job of helping out patrick peterson on the double move he was trying to hit cd on a deep shot they need a touchdown. Field goal won't get it done. 11 seconds to go. Stafford downfield, and his pass is dropped by Swift. He was in the end zone. The rookie linebacker, or the rookie running back, DeAndre Swift, could not hold on. That would have been the touchdown to put the Lions in front. Wow. Instead, it's third and ten. And it was a simple option route that he then turns up. Matthew Stafford catches Danny Trevathan with his back turn. That, that should have been an easy touchdown game winner for the Lions. Wow. Wow. Oh, oh, yeah. So now, look at the prevent defense with only three men up front, six seconds to go in the game. Stafford again going into the end zone. Tim Cook incomplete. And it was Jalen. Johnson. Inside the pocket. He's looking at a third and eight here. Throwing over the middle, and it is almost intercepted. Jamal Adams had it. It's pretty amazing. That's such a cool story. Here he is. Throwing it over. Oh, it's intercepted. Right to the hands of Edelman. And Matthew is able to take it home for the touchdown. Edelman with his second drop of the night, and this one cost his team a touchdown. Need four from the 15. Wentz throwing, and there's the interception. In the end zone, Quandre Diggs. Fly, Seahawks, fly. In well, the Doug, Philadelphia end zone. Doug Peterson talking. Running back is Huntley. The fake hit in. He stays in the block. Once has time. 
Looks looking, keeps his eyes down. Field, and he's going to go down again. And then Donovan Wilson with the ball coming loose. And Dallas has it. Offs it up here. This is a horrible play by Carson Wentz. And sometimes he has been doing this too much. He's making wild plays in the hopes of making something special happen because he doesn't have much around him. But you simply cannot, especially outside the pocket, not just take that ball and throw it out of bounds and live to play again. You're going to see as Wentz scrambles out here to his left. Take a look down the field. When he gets out there, there is literally nobody there. There's nobody on his side. So once you get out there and you go, uh-oh, I scrambled the wrong way. There's nobody over here. Mess a season ago. Here's Guskowski on the way from 47 and no good. Wow. No good. The Titans last year went in a 10-game stretch having just one field goal. That hadn't happened since 1975. You get Guskowski and he misses to the right. That was blocked. Somebody got a piece of that. I think Shelby Harris got a hand on that. At the point of attack and didn't move either one of them. 42-yard attempt. He's missed one, had one block, and no good. No good. Mm, and that's see, the story of the Tennessee kicking game from last season. No good. Out on the field, and Vic Fangio's defense gives up an easy one. A bit of a low snap there. And he missed it. Well, we'll see the execution of that play. That was a low snap from Bo Brinkley. I think he just hooked it, Steve. I think the snap was okay. Got it down okay. He's just, he's not confident. He's completely lost his confidence. Kern did a good job setting that up, too. complete elation of he pulled a calf muscle it looked like and that sideline of the chargers jubilant as he is hurt and he misses a field goal which could have tied the game a 31 yard chip shot is missed well and the chargers weren't even rushing they had a couple of guys pushing up the middle but Coming off the edges, they didn't bring any pressure. What a devastating ending. And you know that what is interesting about Bullock, he had made 24 consecutive field goal attempts inside 40 yards. And the staff cannot believe it. And the Chargers are going to come away with a come from behind win. Watson to the air has already thrown a short touchdown pass today. The heavy pressure applied and coming through Akeem Hicks. And Watson thought that maybe he was uh, mishandled on that play. But Hicks really driving and broke through. Akins completely drops it. But you got to remember that corner of the end zone, you're looking right back into the sun. You could see the, the shadows on that side. And yep. he doesn't even see it. His hands are in one place.